Now to a story you'll see only on nine sentencing in the child abuse case at a local daycare. The incident happened last October at the Mustard Seeds Daycare Center in Ludlow, which has since closed. Bill Price was the only TV reporter to talk with the child's mother today. Bill? Well, Clyde, Alicia Lyons and Justina Rogers both pleaded guilty to charges stemming from the incident. But entering court today, Lyons knew she could potentially face up to 10 years in prison for criminal abuse after admitting to taping a baby to a mat. It was Alicia Lyons who faced the more serious second-degree criminal abuse charges. She admitted to having used Gorilla Tape to tape an 18-month-old boy to his mat during nap time at the Mustard Seeds Daycare Center last fall. Today, she tearfully stood with her lawyer to ask that she be incarcerated at home to be with her own children. I'm really sorry for this. Not meant to happen. She didn't mean her hurt. Just really hurts because I loved all these kids and I loved that job. Kenton County Circuit Court Judge Patricia Sumi gave Lyons a 30-day sentence to be served on weekends. She'll also be on probation for five years, and Lyons will have to take anger management classes and parenting classes. Jacinda Rogers, who admitted to seeing the gorilla taping incident that they care but not reporting it, got two years conditional discharge, which means she could be resentenced if she offends again. Rogers will also have to serve 150 hours of community service. I think the judge did the best she could. The child's mother, Katherine Johnson, and her attorney spoke exclusively with Nine News. Johnson says after learning what happened to her child at the daycare center, she'll never put her children in daycare again. Absolutely not. Never. Why not? I, I don't know if I can trust them again. I just, I just, no way. No way. Now, as part of their sentences, Lyons and Rogers will not be allowed to work with children for at least the next two years and possibly longer. Claude?